Hi, I'm from team Tech Thugs. It all started when our teachers first introduced the SAP hack first. We didn't join out of passion or purpose. Honestly, we joined just to bunk class. Nothing more. We casually picked the theme phishing and online scams, came up with an idea, but we weren't serious. We didn't care. It was just a time pass for us. But then everything changed. Just days before the SAP first round results were announced, a tragedy struck. My hostel mate, my dear friend, took his own life. He was scammed online, lost money, and that loss broke him. That's why I told in the beginning, a man's life often rests on the weight of his reputation. Lose it, and he may feel like he's lost everything. But he was more than just a student. He was a fighter, a sportsman, a champion. Cricket, volleyball, kabaddi, you name it, he played it. Just two weeks before the incident, he had been thrown as the all-rounder champion in our college's annual sports meet. He had a big trophy in his hand. He was famous, respected, and admired, and he made a name for himself. But even his strength, his achievements, and his smile couldn't protect him from the guilt and shame he felt. He lost peace. What hurts even more that he also got selected in the SAP hack first first round, but unfortunately, he couldn't make it. He didn't want to be seen as a failure. He suffered in silence, and we had no idea. His room was next to mine. I used to borrow his hotspot without him knowing, always making fun or joking. He was a tall, strong, athletic, always cheerful. The last words he said to me were, have a safe journey, Ra. but I didn't know that he also going on a journey all alone. At his cremation, his family looked at us and asked, you were always with him, right? We had no words, only guilt and tears. We saw the ashes of a man I once thought was invincible, ashes that would now blown away in the wind. That moment shattered me, but it also woke me up. I knew then this project was never just a project. It was a mission, a calling, and even God's way of putting us on this path. We were selected for the first round for a reason. We got back to work, sat down with real purpose, we researched and built solutions that could truly really make a difference. Because no one, no one should suffer like my friend did. The thought that scammers are out there enjoying the money they stole. The blood money that led my friend to death fuels me every single day. I especially and most heartfully thank NextGrids and SAP for giving us the platform, for opening our eyes and giving us an opportunity to make a change and made our mind to flourish with ideas. They have motivated us through the entire rounds. Today, we stand as finalists. But more importantly, we stand for every silent victim, every unheard cry, every life lost in the shadows of digital scams. We hope we win not just this competition, but this fight for justice, for my friend, for his memory, for the future.